That's one of the rare pieces that's done in oils. I painted it when I was in San Jose, California. Man, that's 35 plus years. Hi, I'm Ted Ellis, the museum director of Sonoma, the creative historian, the black art ambassador. Yes, Walt Disney piece, you know, Danny Glover was there, Alfred Wood, Ben Vereen. You had a whole cast of celebrities there for this event. My love of art, you know, started very early in the um, city known for its rich cultural heritage, New Orleans. It's rich with culture. See all the artists in the square. I was enamored with that. I was um, definitely interested in my upbringing, um, my community. And so as a legacy piece, that's all I wanted to do. I wanted to purpose my paint. You know, I wanted to paint about my history, my heritage, my identity. And uh, when I decided to pursue the art full time, that was my primary purpose and focus. So I can honestly say over a period of, of 30 plus years, I've made a sustainable impact in the preservation of African-American history and culture. If you look at my African-Americans in the legal series, African-Americans in the medical field, if you look at my Buffalo Soldiers, my Tuskegee Airmen, my pictorial anthology of African-Americans and religion, my jazz exhibition, those preserve and tell our stories in a unique manner. It's a, it's a visual narrative. It's not written, but it's visual. What they say is that picture speaks a thousand words. And um, you know, I, I think it speaks a little bit more. I also know that the language of art is universal. So whether you speak two languages or four languages, I speak all of them when I paint. That's the official painting for Juneteenth. I am the official art ambassador for Juneteenth. You know, by the city, the county, the state, and the federal government recognizing that. So that's important. That's the 11th federal holiday. Our history continues to be told. How so the relevance of the importance of, uh, of the art and the preservation of history is so critically important. Um, I think 1998, uh, that was probably my, my biggest accomplishment. That's the um, Walt Disney commemorative poster. That's when Walt Disney came calling. And I became the official artist um, celebrating Black History Month in Lake Point of Vista, Florida at, at Disney World. So, so that shows you the relevance of the art, the relevance of the artist, the relevance of our history and our culture and why it's so critically important.